Today we're going to learn about Venn diagram word problems. Let's say we have a problem, like the math club has 21 members and the science club has 18 members. If a total of 29 students belong to only one club, how many students belong to both clubs? Now to solve this problem, we need to draw a Venn diagram. So let's draw the Venn diagram. Now, it says that the math club has 21 members and the science club has 18 members. So there are two clubs, the math club and the science club. Let's label this circle as the math club. And let's label this circle as a science club. Now, we know that the math club has 21 members and the science club has 18 members. So let's write that in the circles. The math club has 21 members and the science club has 18 members. Now, it also says in the problem that if a total of 29 students belong to only one club, how many students belong to both clubs? So that means that there are some number of students who belong to both the math and the science clubs. Let's label these number of students as S. So there are S number of students who belong to both the math club and the science club. So we know that there are a total of 29 students who belong to only one club. So that means that the number of students who only belong to the math club, to the math club are 21 minus S number of students who are also belonging to the science club and the math club. So let's write that down. 21 minus S number of students who belong to only the math club. That also means that the number of students who belong to only the science club are equal to 18 minus the S students who belong to the science club and the math club. So let's write that down. Minus 18 or plus so 18 students from the science club minus the S students who are both in the science club and the math club. Now, it says that there are a total of 29 students who belong to only one club. So that means that 21 minus S, which are the number of students who belong to only the math club, plus 18 minus S, which are the number of students who belong to only the science club, is equal to 29 students. Let's simplify down this equation. 21 plus 18 is equal to 39. So 39 minus S plus s is equal to 2s. So minus 2s is equal to 29. Now, let's add 2s to both sides of this equation. Plus 2s and plus 2s. Let's also subtract 29 from both sides of this equation. So minus 29 and minus 29.
This way, we get our numbers on one side of the equation and the variables on the other side of this equation. So, 39 minus 29 is equal to 10 and the negative 2s plus 2s cancel out. The 29 minus 29 cancels out and you are left with on this side 2s. So this means that 10 is equal to 2s. Let's write s. So that means that s is equal to 5. So the number of students who attend both the math club and the science club are equal to the 5 students. So let's write that down. There are five students who belong to both the math club and the science club. Let's verify this answer. So, One minus s or 5, so 21 minus s or 5 is equal to 21 minus 5 is equal to 16. And 18, the 18 members from the science class, minus s or 5, 18 minus s or 5, 18 minus 5 is equal to 13. Now, to find out whether the five students belong to both the math and the science class, we need to add up 16 and 13. If 16 plus 13 equals the 29 students who belong to only one club, then there are five students who belong to both clubs. 16 plus 13 does add up to 29. So that means that there are five students who belong to only one club, to be, who belong to both clubs, the math club and the science club. Today we learned about Venn diagram word problems. Thank you for watching this video.